Riverdale's Madeline Petch looks unrecognizable in these new behind the scenes photos of season five of Riverdale. And here is all the details. I'm Jana Rosenberg. I'm Gabby Conti, and this is your 24 7 celebrity news. And that is right, there is a bizarre behind the scenes photo of Cheryl and Reggie that has fans going, huh? And remember, Riverdale is easily one of the wildest and most unpredictable shows on TV. So if fans are confused about what's going on, that is saying a lot. Riverdale showrunner Roberto Aguar Sasca just posted a behind the scenes shot of the new season five episode, which is confusing fans because the characters pictured look almost unrecognizable. Roberto showed this off a behind the scenes shot on Twitter where Betty's back is to the camera holding a knife and is facing Cheryl in a permed dark wig while Reggie is in head to toe leather, including his face. Roberto captioned the photo with, as our second week of hashtag Riverdale wraps, a look back on some of what we shot, including this priceless scene, Betty with a knife, Reggie in leather, and Cheryl in a wig. Yes, folks, it's another quiet night in the town with Pep. Oh my gosh, this is, oh, I just love it. I love that they're filming this during like when fall's starting to happen, mm -hmm. like I'm a big Halloween fan. Like this is just so exciting. Um, also, I feel like there's gonna be many a plot twist Yes. As we can clearly see on social media that we're gonna see in season five. Of course, and they've been like hinting at this, but still, I think what's really exciting is like, it's it's kind of cool that we have this time to kind of piece together and like guess what we think is gonna happen based on what uh, Roberto is showing us. And then so when it actually comes out, yeah. like what fans will be like, oh, I got this right, or I was so off on this, you know? Totally, oof, I'm excited. Uh, so this shot comes only after two weeks of filming, and as of now, there's no clear explanation of what is going on here. But there's a good chance that since production has just started, this show is from one of the earlier episodes of season five, perhaps before the big time jump that we will see. As fans know, we will be getting a senior prom and graduation from season four, and then the show will jump seven years, showing the gang after college in their mid 20s. Fans already have a lot of theories about this behind the scenes shot, of course, as one fan thinks that maybe Cheryl is dressing up as Veronica for some reason. Other theories are that maybe the gang is paying homage to the Rocky Horror Picture Show, which would explain Cheryl's wig, or American Horror Story Murder House, which would explain Reggie's getup. Whoa, lots of twists and turns here. Lots of twists and turns here, but I will say what's interesting is that you can see that from Betty's back is to the camera, but you can see that she's wearing her iconic ponytail. So it's like if, if Cheryl and Reggie are in costumes, right. like Betty isn't for mm -hmm. some reason, maybe we're getting a Halloween episode. That's my guess. Right? I, think it's, I think it's gonna be like graduation, prom, whatever those events that everyone wanted, and then we're gonna get a Halloween episode. Maybe something happens and then it's like a time jump. Well, and it's like what? It could also be after the time jump. This is true. This is true. And it could be Halloween in their 20s. Yeah, so which is for still, a loop there. still Halloween. Still Halloween, honestly, more fun. More fun. <laughs> <laughs> Another behind the scenes look we recently got was insight as to how the cast will serve us their steamy makeout sessions during the pandemic. KJ Appa just gave fans a sneak peek of how they still make out on set without the fear that they could get each other sick. He posted a video on his Instagram of him and Camila Mendez, who plays his love interest on the show Veronica, linking arms as they then sip from their cups filled with mouthwash between takes, and then they rinse their mouths out. They had to swish that mouthwash in their mouth for a whole minute, which I don't know if you've ever had mouthwash in your mouth. That's like a very, very uncomfortable long time. He captioned this video, our new normal is washing our mouths out before every take of a makeout scene. And the top comment is this one concerned fan who wrote, y'all weren't doing that before. Honestly, good point. And good I'm point. not gonna say I wasn't thinking it when I saw this video, cause it's viral on the internet, but I kind of right. was, I was like, I mean, did you not take a break to like, I don't know, do like a breath mint or something? I would. I like would. if I had to kiss my co-star who's also my friend in real life, yeah. I'd be like, hold on. We're gonna have to like right. take a minute so I can prepare for this. Especially and KJ Appa. KJ, and the, those makeout sessions, they are they are hot. They're they are, hot. They're steamy. And I always wondered like, yeah, how are they doing it? And like, and also we were concerned too when we heard they were going back into production. We're like, uh-oh. Yeah. Like, are they not gonna be able to kiss? Right. You know, because COVID. But like, it seems like for some reason, this one minute mouthwash rinse, like I guess. Kills like, all the germs. I bet it's like a special COVID mouthwash or something. You think they're just like rinsing with hand sanitizer? Oh God. No, they're not. Don't do that. Do not gargle with hand sanitizer. That <sighs> one time I idea. accidentally swallowed mouthwash on camera here at Hollywire. Go find it. Find um, it. Anyways, uh, so, but can mouthwash actually help you not get COVID-19? Well, that is up for debate. Exactly. Neil Nato, a former director of public health, wrote about it in a New York Times article back in March where he said, 
There seems to be little downside to frequent gargling, whether gargling will actually fight off colds or flu. However, let alone the more serious coronavirus that is currently circulating remains indeterminate as the current evidence base is limited. So it seems like the mouthwash was more for breath as less to stop the spread. As to what is happening in season five officially, well, it looks like we'll get that new season now in January of 2021 which is not so far away, you guys. We are hitting fall. We are, it's just gonna it's like October tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna zoom right out of 2020. Nobody worry. We're gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Um, but yeah, I am interested about that. But then I'm interested about like the one minute. Like you have to do it for one minute, which makes me think that maybe it yeah, wasn't mouthwash. Maybe it was something a little bit more potent. Antiseptic. Yeah, of some sort. I don't, I don't know, guys. <laughs> well, are you excited for season five of Riverdale? What do you think will happen? And what do you think was going on in that photo? with Cheryl and Reggie and Betty. Like, I still have, I'm, I, I don't know. I want to know. So let us know. I'm Gabby Conti. I'm Jana Rosenberg. And follow us here at Hollywire for your 24-7 celebrity news.